Hello everyone. So have you guys ever wondered in certain situations where the enemy is turn locked or they're just not looking at you, not paying attention to you, what kind of blue focus or charge strike to focus on? In this video we'll be we'll be focusing on that. So first of all, I'll show a summary of the damage numbers which you could be expecting from the weapons. So here I just showed an example of gold weapons. So you can see the differences between the left click and the right click damages. So that the left click being the vertical strikes, the right click being the horizontal strikes. So you will know which left click or right click does more damages and what kind of situations you would be expecting to use them, which would be further explained in the video. So I'll be focusing on all the weapons in this video. So discussing their certain situations where you would use them and how you could optimize your damage numbers in certain situations uh, either in solos or where you see your teammates getting hit or you see your enemies getting stun locked by your teammates as i showed in the clip previously um what kind of blue focus you should focus on when your teammates are focusing down one guy so you first we're going to talk about the longsword so the longsword has a first stack first stage and second stage their first stage being the first thing is the first flash and the second stage being the second thing second flash so the second stage and first stage um the damage differs in the second stage being higher so the longsword has the second stage and first stage the second stage for the longsword the higher one is on the left click so the longsword has a bit of a or miss it's a bit hard to hit but if you're up close to the enemy you want to use a left click which does 170 damage which is 100 more than the right click if the enemy is four you want to do right click next would be katana so the katana the first stage damage is both pretty much the same and the second stage as well so the right click and left click pretty much the same but in team fights you want to use the left click more because they can hit the ground easier. They, they are more widespread. So you won't miss your strikes as much as your right clicks. So the Great Sword. The Great Sword has a lot of damage. The most damage is on the left click. So charge it to 3. If the enemies are not looking at you, charge it to the third strike. And you'll do 1600 damage. The Spear is the just to the spin. Obviously, so second stage, second thing, release it, and then you'll do the spin. For a dagger, the right click does the most damage, but you're not going to be able to hit the enemies because they're going to be, because you're, they're going to get pushed up by your teammates. So you're just going to focus on doing left click, the uppercut strike, and then just dodge around and then left click again. It's the best bet you have. And nunchucks. Nunchucks, the right click with the bar meter full does 1368 damage but if you don't have that just do the left click the left click does more damage than the right click the without the biting fury the bar meter and the next is the dual blade so the dual blade the first stage the left click there isn't much difference uh first stage second stage for the dual blades they're both the same 882 but the left click does a longer stun compared to the right click but the right click does more damage so if you want to hit an enemy um and their stun lock you want to do right click for the quick and fast damage but charge it to second stage then the staff the is the right click the one after you get the pole on top of the pole and then you do the stupid stun 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 thingy so the right click does the most most and then you have the pulse ward so for the pulse ward the right click does the most so you want to support your teammate from behind charge three strikes three things right from behind and then just release it all over them and the last weapon would be dual halberds the dual halberds the right click supreme damage supreme hitbox target thing it really accurately hits them and the range is good as well 
So I would say the two halberd is one of the best ones here. Being that it can charge fast and the right click is very strong and accurate. It does a 1888 damage right click. So for a summary for the weapons, it is that for dual halberds, you want to focus on right click, second stage, full sword, right click, third stage, staff, second stage, right click, dual blades, right click, second stage, nunchuck, right click if you have meter, if you don't have meter, then just do left click, dagger, left click with the dodge stuns, the dodge blue focuses, the spear, the spin with the left click, great sword, left click, third charge, katana, uh, second stage, left click, long sword, second stage, left click if near, right click if far. That's pretty much a summary. Anyways, um, that's for the damage breakdown. Thanks for watching and see you guys next time. Like and subscribe if you want more of this kind of videos. Of, I'm not sure if this is a how-to or a guide. I think this is more of a guide. It's more of a damage breakdown. So yeah, like and subscribe if you want more of this kind of videos. And thank you for watching.